Welcome to the Unity 2.5 Scene View tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate how to move and manipulate objects using the various transform tools available. To begin with, I've loaded this nice looking scene. And I'm going to concentrate on this object, the big stone. Now that I've selected the object, I can click the center of the object to drag it around in order to move it freely. I can also pick one axis and move the object according to that axis. And then it will only be moved in that particular axis constraint. If I want to rotate the object, I can go to this toolbox in the corner and select the rotation tool. The rotation tool allows me to rotate the object freely like this. Or, if you want a little bit more precision, you can choose one of the circles and that will rotate the object according to that axis. Finally, I can use this tool, the Scale tool, to scale the object in size. By clicking in the middle of the object and dragging, I'll scale the object uniformly. If I wish to scale the object on one axis only, I can use one of the axis pointers on the tool. Now I will demonstrate how to navigate around within the scene view. You can do this if you have a three button mouse by holding down the Alt key and left dragging to orbit the scene. middle mouse button drag to pan the scene and right mouse button drag to zoom the scene in and out. Now let go of the Alt key again and with the mouse reel you can scroll to zoom in and out on the scene. Another way to navigate the scene view specifically to rotate the scene view is to use this gizmo up here in the corner. So if you want to see the scene from for example precisely right or front or from below or from the top you can simply click these axes over here and it will align your view to the chosen axis. By clicking the center of the gizmo you will reset to perspective view again. Another handy way to move around in Unity, if you have selected an object like this one for example, and for some reason you lost track of where it is, then you can go to the hierarchy and choose the object, go back into the scene view and then press the F key. This will move your view to put the object exactly in the center of the screen.